Hello and welcome to Mark and Kelly's Trips, Tips and Things. So I'm filming on my phone camera, so sorry for the poor quality or anything like that or if I'm not looking into the lens. So this morning I have decided to go with a work colleague to um, Hawksmoor for breakfast. So I don't quite know the way. I've booked the table for seven in the morning because they open at seven and it's already seven o'clock but I think I'm only about five minutes away so yeah I'm excited um, it's before work so yeah we'll see how it is it's Friday morning and as you can see it's quite dark out let me just do a quick camera flip around sorry for the finger oh no the camera doesn't want to flip around so yeah let me just flip the camera around so as you can see it's quite dark so yeah let's see how we get on um when we get to Hawksmoor I'm very excited I had to bring a work colleague with me because she's a meat eater and my appetite's quite small so obviously I get to share the dish with her the breakfast but Mark obviously is pescatarian so he can't eat the meat so yeah we'll see how it goes um my colleague's just texted me she says she's already there i think i'm now probably about three minutes away so i'll catch you when we get there bye for now okay so here we are at the hawks mall this is the menu if you are interested um so i think we are going for the hawks mall breakfast for two um, and there's quite a lot there so I'm hoping my colleague is not going to make me walk fast back to work because I don't think I'm going to be able to make it <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be able to make this fast walk so as you can see it's quite a uh, quite a good menu you know you have your juices your toast sort of like steak and eggs um, and they even do the porterhouse as well Chateaubriand so quite a few nice cuts of steak there um, with, uh, and you can add eggs and hash brown to any steak for 3 75 um, But yeah, if you can eat steak at that time of the morning, then that's good for you. Um, you have your sandwiches, your fruits and grain, uh, coffee, rare tea company. Um, I have ordered a juice um, and uh, my colleagues ordered a tea. Um, but yeah, you've got some quite nice sort of little things going on here, so yeah. Kipper and poached eggs. Kipper and poached eggs, wow. Yeah, if you like, I don't really like kippers though. Um, I don't like the bones, the fine hair bones. Um, but I think that's more of a psychological thing. I have tried it before, but mm. Okay, so we'll come back and show you what the breakfast looks like. And here is the apple juice. Very nice. Very fancy. Yeah, as I was saying, a fancy apple juice with all the lovely sliced apples there. You can tell it's fresh. So yeah, I'm gonna enjoy that. In fact, let me take a sip and see how it is. That's really fresh. That is proper fresh apple juice. I wasn't expecting that. I was just expecting something from a bottle. I'm not gonna lie. So yeah, nice to begin with. So here is the actual breakfast. It looks absolutely amazing and very large. So you have your bone marrow here. We've got sausages, bacon, black pudding, eggs. I don't even know what we've got underneath. They've got toast, with butter. I'm assuming that's some type of gravy. Maybe. What do you think? And some beans here. And just mm. um, yeah, some mushroom. Mushrooms oh, under those. Um, and, I, and I think some type of. Oh, I can't. Yeah, some the type of cash um, underneath there. So quite a few good things to sort of like try. You can see the bacon. So yeah, we're going to let you know how we get on. Okay, so a quick look at my plate. So I have 
sausage and I have this is the steak uh, hash bubble and squeak um, mushroom trotter beans black pudding which is just under there toast with butter egg and this is actually a bacon chop I thought it was bacon but it's not a steak and chop and there's tomatoes and Dorothy on her plate has got sausage, mushroom, toast. How is it Dorothy? Delicious. Delicious? She says it's delicious. So we'll let you know how we get on. Okay so we've now finished our breakfast and this is what's left. As usual I couldn't eat everything which is yeah uh, normal for me. Um, but it was very tasty. I don't know um, about the bacon chop. I, it wasn't really my... I, I ate half of it. It wasn't very my... my I'm, uh, yeah, I'm always in two minds about bacon gammon. chops. Was oh, was it gammon? Steak. Gammon steak. Oh, gammon steak. No wonder. Um, well, he just came along and whipped our plates away. So, yeah, like I was saying, I'm not sure about the... Um, gammon steak um, I'm, I've never really been a lover of gammon steak or bacon chop or anything like that but still the breakfast was very nice, it's very reasonable as you can see it's £40 for the food, £8.35 for the drinks and we had um, tea and apple juice um, and the, the um, service charge which is £6 for 12.5% so all together Fifty-four, thirty-nine. What did you think of value for money? I think it was quite good. Yeah, I think it was quite good for value for money. So, um, if you want to try the Hawksmoor, um, they put three guests actually, but it's actually two guests, not three. Um, but if you want to come and try the Hawksmoor, definitely recommended for breakfast. Um, there is the price. <coughs> So for fifty four thirty nine, and that's including everything that we you saw that we had earlier. So we hope you like this vlog. Um, please comment. Please put any comments in the comment section. Um, and if you want to keep up with any of our videos, please subscribe to our channel. And if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. All right, take care. Bye for now.